Hello friends, my name is Theo, and today in this exciting Misner Media tutorial, we're going to be taking a look at how to create LUTs inside of DaVinci Resolve. This is thanks to the incredible response I've gotten from the Misner Media House LUTs pack that we just put up. Thank you everyone who has gone and downloaded those. It's been very cool. So, now I'm going to teach you how to make your own, and you know maybe you can make your own LUT packs. So, let's hop into DaVinci Resolve and get started. Got this good shot of an airport. We'll just do a quick grade on this real fast. Maybe I'll bring the contrast up some, maybe even a little bit more. Move the pivot around, and that's looking pretty good for that. We'll crank the saturation all the way up, and we will move the gamma, magenta, the lift down there, gain right like that, and we'll call that good. So now say you really like this and you want to save it out, what you will do is just go over here to this little thumbnail view and right click on whatever clip you've graded. And you go over to generate 3D LUT and I like to use these cube ones because I've never had a problem with them. So just click on that and then automatically it will go to wherever you have your LUT stored in DaVinci Resolve, which is normally where you'll save them. But if you want to make your own thing, you can feel free to go over to something like your desktop maybe. So go over to Theo and desktop and we'll just save this as tutorial LUT. And I will give this one away for free. So just go over to MiesnerMedia.com and click on the Downloads tab and you'll see a public Dropbox folder where you can download a couple of different free things. Now we've got it right here. And it will automatically put your clip name after it. So I'll normally just go ahead and take that away. And look at that, tutorial.cube. And then from here you can just import it back into DaVinci Resolve if you want to or use it in Premiere or After Effects or Speedgrade or Photoshop or Lightroom or whatever you want. So I hope you enjoyed this little tutorial. Thanks again for all the people who have downloaded the Mies New Media House LUT pack. If you haven't already, just go to MiesNewMedia.com slash products and pick up a copy for yourself. It is super excellent. I use those LUTs all the time, so you should too. It makes your life really easy. If you like this video, give it a like. If you didn't, give it a dislike. No matter what, leave your feelings down in the comments below. If you want to see more videos like this, be sure to subscribe to the Meesner Media YouTube channel. If you want to see even more Meesner Media goodness, we've got links for our socials down in the description below. Be sure to share this video with your friends so they can maybe even make you some lots. You can share yours around your little community. It'll be really cool. Once again, I've been Theo with Meesner Media. I hope you have a great day, and I will see you next time. Bye.